All right, guys, we're back. Hey, everybody. Today we're going to be doing the humanitarian daily ration, and uh, it should be very interesting. So they label this as a full day's meal, but it's kind of like one meal at the side. Uh, so essentially what's going to happen here, if we drop any food aid to Ukraine or anybody else, they always get these. Are they good? Usually not. Right. Usually they're very bland. Sadly, no. um, but regardless, we're opening it up. So we got a few of these. We'll figure we speckle these in here and there. But any food, I'm sure they'd be they're appreciative kind of. of. All right. Oh. Stage prop. Right, by the way. All right. Double bag. <laughs> okay. Ooh, sweet potato and grape smoothie. I think I've had that before. Mm. You'll be. Wait, that sounds like the worst thing I could possibly. <laughs> it is. Strawberry jam. Hopefully, this strawberry jam won't be brown like the other stuff we had yesterday. Sunflower butter. That's interesting. There's a lot of it too. Look at that. Huh. Never had sunflower butter. Crackers, a highly reflective cracker. Oatmeal cookie. Oatmeal cookie is the camera freaking out, holding that up there. More strawberry jam. Another strawberry jam. Bean salad. Beans with potatoes. Maybe I should have gave a packet with some X, so not X Lax, uh, Gas X. <laughs> and there's no toilet paper in there either. Oh man. Nope. You got to use your hand, boys. Better hope you have a sock. Cut the bottom of your t-shirt off. Whatever it takes to get her done. Pepper. I dye salt. And a fresh nap moist towelette. A spoon, and that is it. One thing I noticed there's no drinks in here. You can at least give you a little coffee well, or tea besides or Besides for the smoothie, yeah. But still for a whole day though. Yep. I mean, you're not going to have a drink. You're not going to have... Well, I guess you'll be eating crackers. Yeah. And uh, oh, something else is odd. You have one pack of crackers and two things of jam. This is like a peanut butter, usually, kind yeah, of, so maybe. Yeah, all three of that for... It does look a little bit... Crackers. Is it puffed up, or is that much in it? What do you I think? think it's... That much in it? I think there's that much in it. Okay, let's get the tray. Let's see what it's all about. Let's dissect... Philip said this is really messing with the camera, all this foil. Is there a cookie? Looks good. Probably the best damn thing in the whole ration. Probably so. Put that over there. I'll try to cut these open so we don't... Smash them. Yep, because if you try to get them out of the Probably. package without doing that, we you will have happens. a giant mess. Okay, and we only need one I'm of these jams that. out here. We'll I'm toss that to the, the side. The floor. <laughs> crumbs everywhere. And then squidge yeah, around here. Up. Shake it up a little bit. Sweet potato and grape smoothie. Mmm. Like thick like applesauce. Oh, oh. splash my <laughs> Oh, nasty. Okay. It's like baby food, man. That goes right in the trash can. If I set that mess down on the counter here, we're all gonna be wearing. I'm it afraid in five between minutes. that and the beans, things are gonna get flowing. And I'm gonna set these kind of there, maybe out of the way a little bit. Got two more cups to so divide that up with. Oh man, do you want a cup or just probably a spoonful? It's probably enough. Okay. Out of that. Yeah. True. Let's we'll okay. each take a spoonful. We got our mains here. Let me pull them out of the kettle. Give them a little wipe off. The babies are smoking hot. Very much so smoking hot. So I did order 
clear bowl. You know what, Nathan? I'm thinking this bean salad probably should have been cold. Oh, come on now. You're ruining all the uh, fun. You probably just ruined it, but. Nah, I think it was already ruined. Uh, oh, well, we'll see. The bean salad. Yeah, I would have ate it cold, but we'll see. Well, it's hot now. They'll let us know in the comments how it's oh, supposed to be. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure they will. I'm sure. I didn't even think about it before you put that in there. All right. Like I said, I apologize if we have all clear bowls coming. They're not here yet. So it is what it is. The bean salad. Oh, man. Now, we have like three bean salads here. I'm not sure exactly what kind of beans in there, but yeah, usually it's... it's ten. Ten oh, bean salad. Looks like poop. you have to wipe that knife off when you're done. <laughs> Looks like poop. Let's see here. Kind of looks like chili, actually. Slimy. Look at that. That's the best part. So I'd say what? Chili beans, kidney beans. I'm not take sure a what smell. the third one is. Take a smell of it and see. Pinto? I don't know. I can smell that. It's the good stuff. It's hard to smell it. It just smells like, I don't know, Farts. barely smells like beans. It doesn't really have much of a smell. Crumbs everywhere. Beans with potatoes. Well, it looks like the same thing with just a little potato in there, really. Okay, this is very strange. It's very hot, I can promise you that. Maybe some peppers in there, tomatoes maybe. Imagine. Put yourself in the situation. Yeah. Ukraine. They said that the city of Kiev was bigger in Chicago. Mm. And now it probably looks about the same. Yeah. <laughs> Very sad. Anyhow, Very sad. I was like, that's not funny. You no, know, I'm at least but we're, we're you're imagine a few days or a week or two before you're eating like a nice restaurant. And then this this falls out of the sky. But you know what? To some people you'd be eating like a king if you ate this. So yep. Double beans, though, you're not gonna be able to hide from anybody. They'll be here. They'll hear you coming. All right, what do you want here? You want a um, fork? It doesn't really matter. Just give me a fork. Yeah, that's fine. There you go. Okay, so the three bean salad, correct? Just so slimy. Oof. I'm trying to get it to stay on the fork long enough for me to drag it's it like over here. It's like oily, is what it is, I think. Right. Actually, warm it, it's not bad. A little really bit of, not bad. A little bit of vinegar in it, don't it? I was going to say, what's that like jelly, like gel substance? I'm tasting some kind of a... I'll fill it in there and give him a little trickle up. One thing I can assure you is better warm. There is some kind of a, a seasoning on that. Like vinaigrette. Vinegar. Yes, vinaigrette. Still, though, I, I'm telling you. Because cold stuff in the retort pouch has that taste to it. Mm -hmm. And that doesn't have the taste because it's warm. It's really not that bad, honestly. I don't mind it at all. Yeah. Okay. Beans and potatoes. Good. Let me make sure I get a potato on there. I guess there's no meat in there, huh? No. They usually don't put meat in these because, you know, it has to be halal or it has to be this, it has to be that. Vegetarians got to be able to eat it. I'm swishing around my mouth. It's like, I um, still feel like there's a gel substance in there. It tastes pretty much like this, with, except without the vinaigrette. Ugh. It's not very good. No, it's not very good at all. Here's the thing. I just feel like it's got a slimy consistency to it. Here's the thing. Could you eat it? Yes. Yeah, I could eat it. Would you eat it and say, this is great? No. But if that's all I had to eat, I'd be pretty damn happy. What do you think? Think it's a I'd slimy? I'd to like it. Slimy, do you think? You can see little icicles of gel or whatever. I don't yeah. know what she's talking about. Kind of like when you get like a, the Vienna sausage is the gel or something. I don't know. Yeah, I prefer the three bean salad over that. All right. Yeah. Oh, now the smoothie, the sweet potato and grape smoothie. Ooh. Philip's like, you know, that looks delicious. Okay. Boy, my stomach's not going to be happy with me today. Okay. 
if you ate both of these, all that. Ooh, it's not. Good. It's very bland. Tastes like baby food, not gonna lie. Not really that sweet. It's not bad. It's better than I thought. The gray part kind of saves it a little bit. Yeah. It kind of looks like oil on top of it, actually. Garlic. Let's be honest here. I make the world's worst vegan or vegetarian. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, all you vegans, but I got to have some meat. Just saying. What do you think? No what good. Odd How much to drink that? Yeah, that is a very odd combination, oh, isn't it? How much? How much to eat both of these and drink that? Oh, your stomach would be bucks. so bloated. 40 bucks? <laughs> oh. Yeah. You gotta raise your prices. Oh, yeah. You, you, oh, you're gonna be able to pass it pretty easy. <laughs> Violently, one might say. Violently? No. <laughs> okay, now we got the nasty out of the way. Let's start getting better here. Let's get some crackers. Yeah, with let's some, shuffle uh... this mess back. Ugh. Okay. <clears throat> and let's grab strawberry jam. First one up. Give her a good old squidge around there. Here's the thing. Here's, here's what I want to say about this. Whoever in the government's listening needs to hear this. <laughs> Watch out. Why? They are listening, don't you know that? Why? <laughs> FDA, if you're listening, you're mad at us for buying stuff from other countries. That's probably more deadly than anything we ever reviewed other than the Sistrami. I mean, I guess beans are protein that it's going to be filling, but I feel like there's but other things. The seasoning on it is bizarre. I feel like protein bars. You need to have protein bars in here. Something, you know... That's just too much bean. But yeah, after our vomit on Monday and our fish on Wednesday, ugh, now this on today. Strawberry jam. Yeah, let's try some of that. <sighs> These crackers just. Oh, I knew that was gonna Holy happen. Holy crap! <laughs> Please, this jam looks a little bit better than the other day, but. Still, it's got that brown. Hold it. Ah. Hope you're gonna try some. Here, I want you. I want you to wrestle that. The jam is not good. bad. It's, it's yeah. high fructose corn syrup in a gel form. Right. Let's be honest. The crackers are a little stale. Obviously, they always are. I think we're getting spoiled. Mm hmm On a lot of the better rations. Yeah. True. And I feel like on the vomit, that was the first one I was, it was actually making me sick. Look at it. <laughs> it wasn't gross. that the taste was so horrendous, it was the, the, the look, look of up it. Here, yeah, appearance of it. It just seemed like it was just total garbage. What do you think? Pure sugar? It's pretty good though. I'm kind of yeah. curious to try that. Like I said, I've never had sunflower butter. I've had almond butter, peanut butter, obviously. Sunflower butter is pretty good. It's not bad. Is it oily, usually? Probably. Yeah, it's oily. Oh, well, that looks like straight up. Oh food. man, a few. It's almost not green. Buy appearance on this. The colors. Smells good. Let me see. I mean, we're making a heck, heck of a mess with these crumbs. It's different. I mean, it's like peanut butter. Yeah, it does taste like peanut butter. Very oily peanut butter. Probably a little squidge. Not quite as dry as peanut butter, let's be honest. But it's runner up. I feel like with the beans and the crackers and all this salty stuff. Watch where you set that, Philip, because it's probably going to poop up the whole tray. And you don't have any water. I mean, hopefully you'd have good water where you were at, but chances are probably not. I'll tell you what, after you eat those saltine crackers and some uh, sunflower butter, you're going to be looking for some water quick like. And that oatmeal cookie, too. Oatmeal cookie. Man, this looks so crappy, right? <laughs> We're just such a mess. Like a bunch of rats. A little cinnamon action going. Our apologies for the messy here. It is. The cookie's very, not hard. A cookie, it smells good. It is very dry in the middle. I mean, I don't know. Hmm. Mm. It's, it's the best part of the ration. Yeah, I like the, the seasonings in there, like the, the spices, I should say. 
Kind of tastes like a pumpkin or something. Like pumpkin spice a little bit in it? Mm -hmm. Like probably nutmeg or cinnamon, you're right. So I remember watching a video. I'm trying to remember what that was on, somewhere on YouTube. And was it Syria? It's been several years ago. And they dropped a bunch of these on their country. And the locals couldn't eat it. They said it was like wrecking their stomachs. Mm -hmm. So I just don't understand like why the government, the same way the U.S. rations. I understand you want it to last forever, like 30 years and not go bad. But man, at what cost is that? But be a little more considerate. I mean, would the government officials eat this? Probably Here's my not. thoughts of it. We did away with all the canned goods and rations back in the, what, early 70s. What soldier would not want to pack around another two ounces to have something in a can? Mm -hmm. Not only in a can, you could heat it up over a fire, heat up on the truck engine, and it's obvious if it's, if it's bad or not, but when you squeeze out of a pouch, it looks different. It has to have an extreme amount of preservatives in it, and... I just don't, I don't get it. I don't know. Like, what are we even doing? And the thing is, it does not say on the bag what's in it. So, However, once you're trying to second guess the government, that's a whole other situation. Mm -hmm. yeah, Everything's done backwards. <laughs> yeah. So the best part is the oatmeal cookie. The worst part, I'd say it's a toss up between that smoothie and the beans and potatoes. Yep. What do you think? Interesting ration. That's all I got to say. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's well, that's going to be it. Like if you don't see four. us ever again, you know what happened? <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we'll be back, um, so we'll Monday. Back, yes, Monday for hopefully the Ukrainian one will come in. We'll just have to see. Yeah, we got some other stuff too. Whatever gets here first, Ukrainian right. one is definitely our top priority right now. Right. And, uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. All right. Have a good one.